Today, we're diving into a crucial topic. The five middle-class money traps that might be hindering your financial growth and keeping you broke. But don't worry, we've got the solutions to help you navigate through these pitfalls and secure your financial future. Number one, not having a budget. Let's delve deeper into the significance of having a budget. Many people overlook the power of a budget in shaping their financial well-being. It's not just about tracking expenses. It's about taking control of your financial destiny. When you have a budget, you gain a clear understanding of where your money is going, allowing you to allocate it purposefully. A budget acts as your financial roadmap, guiding you toward your goals, whether it's saving for a house, starting a business, or planning for retirement. It empowers you to make informed decisions, ensuring that your spending aligns with your priorities and values. Moreover, a budget offers insights into potential areas where you can cut back on expenses and save more. By identifying unnecessary expenditures or areas where you're overspending, you can redirect those funds towards your financial objectives. However, the beauty of budgeting isn't just in its creation but in its consistent application. It's essential to regularly review and adjust your budget, considering changes in income, expenses, and financial goals. This adaptability ensures that your budget remains an effective tool in your financial journey. Remember, a budget isn't about restriction. It's about empowerment. It grants you the freedom to spend consciously on things that truly matter to you while curbing impulsive or frivolous expenses that hinder your financial progress. Take the time to create a budget that suits your lifestyle and financial aspirations. And most importantly, stick to it. It might require some discipline, but the rewards of financial stability and achieving your goals are absolutely worth it. Number two, not negotiating and seeking discounts. Many individuals shy away from haggling or seeking better deals, assuming that the listed price is non-negotiable. However, the reality is quite the contrary. Negotiation is a powerful tool in your financial arsenal. Whether you're purchasing a product or availing a service, remember that the price isn't always fixed. Asking for a discount or negotiating can lead to substantial savings. Even a small reduction in price or added benefit can accumulate into significant savings over time. Negotiation isn't about being confrontational but about advocating for your best interest. It's about expressing value and building a mutually beneficial agreement. Start by doing your research. Understand the market value, competitors' prices, or ongoing promotions. This knowledge arms you with leverage when discussing prices. Moreover, don't hesitate to ask for discounts, especially in situations where you're a loyal customer, buying in bulk or even simply inquiring about available promotions. Many businesses appreciate customer loyalty and are often willing to provide discounts or additional benefits. Remember, negotiating isn't limited to retail. It extends to services such as negotiating rates for utility bills, insurance premiums, or even monthly subscriptions. The potential savings from these negotiations can positively impact your budget and overall financial health. By incorporating negotiation and seeking discounts into your financial habits, you empower yourself to make more cost-effective decisions, maximizing the value of every dollar spent. It's a skill that, when practiced consistently, can significantly contribute to your long-term financial well-being. Number three, relying on loans for major purchases. Let's unpack the trap of relying on loans for major purchases. In today's consumer-driven society, it's common to finance significant expenses through loans. While loans offer immediate access to desired items, this convenience often masks the long-term financial impact. Taking out loans, whether for a house, a car, or other substantial purchases, can lead to a cycle of debt if not managed carefully. While it might seem convenient at the moment, it's crucial to consider the long-term effects on your financial well-being. Firstly, loans often come with interest, which means you're paying more than the sticker price of the item in the long run. This interest accrues, adding to the overall cost and potentially tying up a significant portion of your income over the loan's duration. Moreover, loans contribute to financial stress and limit your financial flexibility. Monthly loan repayments can eat into your budget, leaving less room for other essential expenses or saving for the future. Instead of relying solely on loans, consider saving up for major purchases. This approach not only reduces the overall cost by eliminating interest, but also cultivates a healthy financial habit of saving and planning for the future. It might require patience and discipline but the financial freedom and peace of mind it brings are invaluable. Making informed decisions about when and how to use loans is crucial. Evaluate whether the purchase is a necessity or a want. For essential items, explore alternatives, like used or budget-friendly options, to minimize the need for hefty loans. Understanding the implications of relying on loans for major purchases empowers you to be more discerning in your financial choices, ensuring that your financial health remains strong and resilient against unnecessary debt burdens. Number four, 
overlooking small expenses. While it's easy to focus on major expenditures, the cumulative impact of small, everyday purchases should not be underestimated. These seemingly insignificant expenses can stealthily erode your financial stability over time. Consider this. The daily cup of specialty coffee, frequent takeout meals, subscription services, or impulse buys may seem harmless individually. However, when aggregated, these seemingly inconsequential expenses can significantly impact your financial health. To tackle this trap, it's essential to adopt a mindset of financial mindfulness. Start by tracking your expenses, no matter how small. Utilize budgeting apps or simply keep a detailed record of every expenditure. This practice offers a clear picture of where your money is going and enables you to identify patterns in your spending habits. Once you've identified these small expenses, evaluate their necessity and impact on your financial goals. Is that daily takeout coffee contributing to your happiness in a way that justifies its cost? Could that monthly subscription be replaced with a more cost-effective alternative? Implementing small changes in your spending habits can yield substantial savings. For instance, brewing coffee at home, meal prepping, or reviewing subscriptions can redirect funds toward more meaningful financial goals, such as building an emergency fund or investing for the future. Being mindful of these smaller expenses doesn't mean eliminating all enjoyment from your life. It's about consciously allocating your resources towards things that truly align with your priorities and long-term aspirations. By recognizing the significance of these minor expenses and making thoughtful adjustments, you pave the way for a more financially secure future while ensuring that your resources are used purposefully and efficiently. Number 5. Procrastination and Delaying Financial Goals Let's tackle the often underestimated trap of procrastination when it comes to financial goals. Postponing financial planning is akin to putting your dreams on hold. It's easy to push tasks related to finances to the back burner, believing there's always a better time to start. But here's the truth. The perfect time is now. Delaying financial goals not only stints your progress but also incurs a hidden cost, the cost of lost opportunities and compounded growth. Every day that passes without taking action is a missed chance to secure your future. The power of small steps should not be underestimated. Starting today, even with incremental progress, can yield substantial results in the long run. Whether it's setting up an emergency fund, investing in a retirement plan, or paying off debts, every step counts. Commitment and consistency are the keys to overcoming procrastination. It's about forming habits that drive you closer to your financial aspirations. Whether it's setting a budget, researching investment opportunities, or seeking financial advice, these small yet consistent actions build momentum towards your goals. Moreover, remember that perfection isn't the goal, progress is. Financial planning is a journey, not an overnight success story. Embrace the learning curve, celebrate achievements, and learn from setbacks to keep moving forward. By taking action today, you're investing in your future self. You're securing a better tomorrow by making thoughtful choices today. So, start now. Even the smallest step can ignite a chain of positive change propelling you towards the financial future you envision. Embrace the power of now. Every decision, every action towards your financial goals, no matter how small, is a step in the right direction. Don't let procrastination rob you of the life you aspire to live. Start today and stay committed. Identifying and avoiding these middle-class money traps is the first step towards securing your financial future. By being aware and making conscious decisions, you can break free from these traps and pave the way towards financial stability. Remember, your financial freedom starts with the choices you make today.